Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Totally Accurate Battle Simulator. And today, I am going to be completing the Dynasty Campaign. So, the last few episodes, I've been going through the levels here. The first few levels that I did, I had to go up against the new units. And then last episode, I got to use the new units. And I made it all the way over here to the two formations. So, that's going to be where I'm going to start today. So here we are. Uh, what are you doing? This guy just started spinning around. Oh, great. That's not good. That should hopefully make it easier for me to take them out. They're just gonna, like, be spinning around in circles. But I think what I'm gonna use, I'm gonna use some ninjas. Because ninjas are pretty powerful. You know, I might put them a little bit further back. That way they have uh, a little bit more time. So I'll put two ninjas over there. You know what? A dragon might actually be good. Because they're in a big group. So I might put a dragon on that side, and then I'll put an extra ninja over there. So let's see. We got a dragon coming in. He's burning all of these guys. Oh, right. They have snake archers. Uh, it looks like uh, the ninja survived. Now the dragon's trying to burn these guys over here, which apparently he's doing a decent job. Oh, right. They just took out the dragon. Come on, ninjas. There we go. The ninjas came in and took him out. Perfect. So let's see. What is the next? Oh. Apparently, we've got a Minotaur. We actually have two Minotaurs. So, you know what? I'm gonna use... Should I do the Monkey King? Because this guy's crazy. I can actually afford two of them. So, I'm gonna put some Monkey Kings, and then I'll put some Ninjas in. So, let's see... Oh, right. I think the Minotaur just took out my Ninja. But here's the Monkey King. Look at him taking out everyone. What happened to the Minotaur? Oh, he's alive. Apparently, they didn't take him out yet. These guys are just getting thrown around by the Monkey King. I think he's got his stick, like, stuck behind his back. I don't know how we did that. Oh, right. I think this might be a loss for us. We've only got, I think, one... Yep, yep, that we lost. We only had one Monkey King left. Yeah, these Minotaurs are powerful. So, you know what? I'm gonna try some arrows. So, if I put two of these in, I'll go ahead and put those in the back. And then, what should I use for a distraction? I have enough for two dragons. But I don't think that's going to be a good idea. So I'm going to put some monks in. So I'll put some of these guys. And then you know what? I have enough for a ninja. So what if I put him up here? Will he survive or is he going to fall off? Come on, ninja. Good. He's doing a good job. He's taking out these guys. The arrows came in and took out a bunch of these guys. Over here, uh, the monks are doing a pretty good job. Oh, right. The arrows just came in and took out basically all my guys. Did they take out any of theirs? Okay, there we go. Arrows came in and took them out. For a second, I thought the arrows didn't take out a single one of their guys and they just took out mine. But apparently, the arrows came in and got rid of the rest of their units. And here's the ninja. The ninja did survive, so that's good. So what do we have next? Oh, we got a Zeus. Perfect. So you know what? I don't think Zeus can survive arrows. So we're going to put a bunch of arrows in there and then... I guess some samurai. We'll just do an army of samurai. Let's see how this goes. Because these arrows have amazing range. And because they're in like one big line, it should do some decent damage. Oh, great. I forgot the lightning's going to like zap through all of my samurai. Wait, how did I get defeated? Oh, the lightning hit this thing. I didn't know the lightning could go that far. Okay, so you know what? Give her the samurai. I'm going to put ninjas in. Oh, I can't put that many ninjas. I can only put three. But here comes the arrows. Took out... How many units did it take out? It took out a decent amount. Didn't take out all of them. Because these shields actually do a pretty good job protecting from the arrows. As you can see there. Look at the amount of arrows that are stuck in this guy's shield. Yeah, I don't think this is going to work. Is Zeus still here? Yeah, Zeus is still here. Oh, great. Look at this. He's got like 50 arrows in his shield. That's a really strong shield. I think this might be a loss for us. Come on. What was that? You just, like, attack the building. You literally hit nothing with that. All right, so I've got a new idea here. I'm going to try and control the arrows, and I'm going to see if I can go after Zeus. Let's see. Are any of those... Wait, I think we hit him. Oh, right. I got to watch out for that lightning. But I think I got him a little bit there. There we go. We'll fire some more in there. I want to make sure I don't hit any of my guys. But if I fire again, I'm trying to fire. Oh, yes. I did it. 
There we go. We took out Zeus with all the arrows. And the, the monks survived as well. Looks like a decent amount of them survived this, which is pretty good. So that is the next level done. So let's see what we have to do now. Oh, great. We got ballistas. So you know what? I might put a dragon in. How close can I get the dragon? I can put him like right here. So I'm going to put the dragon so I can hopefully take out these guys. And then firework archers. I'm just going to get a bunch of these guys. You know, I might actually get rid of some and put some ninjas in. There's some ninjas. So let's see. Here comes the fire. Took out all these guys. And here comes the fireworks. Oh, great. I think that was one of the ballista bolts. Wait. One of my ninjas got hit with a firework. Really? Hopefully he's going to survive. Wait, someone catch him. Why don't you catch my ninja? Oh, great. Wait, did he survive? He survived. Perfect. Okay, my ninja's alive. The ballistas have just gotten attacked with arrows. There we go. We just have one left. Come on. The ninja who survived the fall is going to come in and take out this ballista. There we go. That is victory. This guy is just flying away on the firework. So let's see what the next one is. Oh, no. We got more Zeus's. So you know what? I'm going to get some arrows and a bunch of firework archers. Seem to do a pretty good job. And some ninjas. I'll put one ninja and a monk here in the front. So let's see how this goes. We got our ninja here. We got our monk. Oh, great. I forgot about all the arrows. Look at this shield. This shield's like a rocket ship. Look at it go. Wait, there goes another one. Okay. That was pretty crazy. Oh, right. There goes all our archers. There goes everyone. Everyone's dead. Okay. You know what? We're going to try this again. All right. So I'm going to try what I did in the last run. I'm going to try and control the arrows. Oh, right. I've just tipped it over. That's not what I wanted to do. All right. Just fire. Fire at the Zeus. Okay, I don't know if we got anyone with that. Apparently, the dragons are dead. So, I'm just going to fire the arrows over in that direction. Apparently, they got the Zeus. He's flying in the air with the fireworks, which is nice. We'll just spray some more arrows in there. Let's head over here. Okay, one of the Zeus's is dead. The other one is stuck with a firework, which is good. But there goes two, three. Look at the lightning. It just, wait, did it hit him? I think it just like zapped around and hit him. But here comes, here comes the arrows. And that is all of the Zeus is dead. And apparently this person got zapped with lightning right before Zeus got taken out by the arrows. So let's see, what do we have now? Oh, bunch of, oh great, are these the berserkers? Um, you know what, here's the dragon. Here's a bunch of dragons actually. So I'm going to put some dragons in and then... I guess firework archers seem to be pretty good. So I'll put some of those in. There comes the fire. I don't know what's going on with my dragon. What is my dragon doing? I didn't know you could fly. Oh, wait. I think that was the firework archers that did that. I think the firework archers may have hit my dragon. There we go. Somehow in this crazy mess, we took out everyone. I don't really know what happened, but we got a bunch of archers now. And some more berserkers. So you know what? I'm going to do a samurai army over here. And then I'm going to do a samurai army over here. And then one ninja in the middle to hopefully take out these guys. So let's see how this goes. All right. So the samurai are going after the berserkers. They seem to be doing a pretty good job. These guys have taken out all of the berserkers. Now they have to go after the ice archers. Which the good thing about the samurai is they can deflect arrows as you can see. That's why I chose the samurai, because they had so many archers here. And you can see all the arrows are just getting deflected. And they're basically coming from both sides. And I think that's going to be a victory. Look at this guy. He's got his sword above his head. He was kind of late to the party, but there we go. We got another victory. Oh, now they've got some Valkyries. Perfect. You know what? Valkyries, we're going we're gonna to get some archers. So I'm going to get some archers and probably some more samurai. Because in a big group like that, they're actually pretty good. So let's go ahead and get a bunch of samurai here to distract. Did you miss? I'm pretty sure all the archers missed. Oh, great. This is not looking good. Come on, archers. They didn't hit anyone. Oh, wait. No, they hit these guys. 
I was hoping they would take out the Valkyries, but apparently they're not very good at hitting them. Okay, so the firework archers didn't work. So we're just gonna fire a bunch of arrows at them. Let's see if this works, because they do kind of attack in groups, as you can see. So hopefully, if these can reload, they can hopefully take them out. There we go. Here comes the arrows. We took out, hopefully, both these guys. We took out that one. Okay, here comes a bunch of arrows. Can we get one of the Valkyries? Did they miss? Okay, we got one of them. Okay, we got two of them. Perfect. Now all you have to do is reload and get the rest of them. So I'm going to go in and control this guy so we can back up. And we're dead. Now I'm going to try this one more time, but this time I'm going to control the arrows. Why are they going over there? I was aiming for them to go that way. Okay. Oh, right. Here comes the Valkyries. Fire the arrows. Okay, there we go. We took out those. All that's left are these guys. So let's take them out with the arrows. There we go. Yeah, I don't think these shields help them very much. This guy got hit in the head. This one just got destroyed with most of the arrows hit this guy. So let's see what the next level is. I don't actually know how many are left. But now they've got jarls and they've got boats. So you know what? I'm going to get a dragon. You know, the dragons are kind of like the boats. But uh, the dragons do a lot more damage, I feel like, than the boats do. The boats kind of just take out their own guys sometimes. And then the rest of the units, I'm just going to put a bunch of ninjas. Because those guys are pretty strong. Uh, let's see. This is not looking good. They're taking out a lot of my guys. The ninjas are alive, though. Wait! We got a ninja with a small head over here. These guys are always the best. Oh, right. This is not looking good. Even the guy with the small head. Wait, he's still alive. I thought he died, but I think he might survive. Oh, right. He just got frozen. He's still going after this Jarl, though. I think he's the only person left. See, the units with small heads are so much stronger. Oh, right. He just got taken out. All right, so I decided to put some Monkey Kings in. So hopefully these guys can get rid of all of the units while the arrows will hopefully come in and take out the Jarls. As you can see, they're doing a really good job at kind of distracting everyone here. They're actually doing a really good job. Oh, here comes some arrows. Let's see. Are they both still alive? Yeah, I think both of the Monkey Kings are still alive. They're going after this Jarl. Here comes some arrows. There we go. We took out one Jarl. Come on. We just have to take out this last Jarl, and then we can win. All oh, right. He just took all of the arrows. Come on. We need, like, one more set of arrows. I'm going to go ahead and control this so I can fire. What? Why is this Jarl so powerful? What? How did you survive? You know, I'm going to try this again. All right, so I'm trying the battle again. I decided to replace my ninjas with some monks. Oh, we still have the two monkey kings here doing a decent amount of damage. Oh, right. Did they die? Oh, wait. No, they're still alive. That's good. Here comes some arrows. The, the, there's one monkey king left. Oh, wait. No, I think he died. Right. It's all up to the arrows. Hopefully, they can take out... Oh, no. Not this again. Come on. Fire. Here, I'm going to fire the arrows. There we go. We took out one of them. Now, hopefully, if I can run away from this guy... I can get a reload in in time. There we go. I finally defeated him. That is the final Jarl. Perfect. So let's see. How many levels are left? Oh, wait. That was the, the final one. That was the final level in the Dynasty campaign. So we've got a, a few more left here. I think the next one I might do is probably the Pirates. I think the Pirate one sounds pretty cool. So I might do that one next. And then maybe I'll go back to, like, the challenge levels, like, later on. But before I end the episode, I want to do some more sandbox. So I want to do one of the simulation maps. Yeah, so I think last time I did the bridge. So this time, I might try the hill. Let's see what the hill is like. Oh, okay. So it's basically a flat platform where it just goes up. So, what kind of units? Oh, we can use the secret unit. You know what? I haven't used the Samurai Giant. Where's he at? Yeah, Samurai Giant. Here he is. Oh, he's really big. Wait, where's a uh, regular Samurai? There we go. There's a size comparison. So, you know what? Let's test out this guy. Because I haven't used him yet. So, let's put... You know, we'll do one Samurai Giant with a bunch of Samurai around him. Can I fit one there? 
Okay, there we go. I can put one there. There we go. So we've got 25 samurai on this side. So I'm going to see what army I can make that can take out 25 samurai. Okay, so I've got all the different factions that I've unlocked so far. So let's get... I don't want to use a mammoth because I feel like he's going to be too powerful. But I'm going to put a king. So the king is going to be kind of like leading the army. And then we're going to put some two knights, a bunch of squires, and then maybe some archers. I'll put some archers like way here in the back. And then in the front, we're just going to put an army of clubbers. You know, we'll do 50. 50 versus 25. So here we go. We've got our clubbers. We got our knights. We got our king, a bunch of squires, and some archers versus the samurai army. Here we go. Who is going to win? Look at this. This is crazy. We've got, all oh, right, the giant samurai is getting ready to swing. And, oh, what? He just took out, like, all of the clubbers. And I don't know what happened to those guys. They apparently got taken out. Look at these, this guy. What did, did, did he just do a backflip? What is he doing? Oh, great. Come on, King. We got to take this guy out. No, he's doing front flips. Look at this guy. Um, come on, archers. Oh, wait. Is he deflecting all the arrows? I think he... Oh, wait. No, he's not. Okay. Come on. It's all up to the archers. You can take this guy out. Oh, great. Wait. Did we do it? No. We definitely didn't do it. He's still doing his front flips. Oh, great. Okay. We're going to need something a little bit more powerful if we're going to take this guy out. So, you know what? We're gonna, we're gonna bring in the spear throwers. The tribal people are gonna help and they're gonna give us a bunch of spear throwers. There's a bunch of those. I might get some wheelbarrows. What if I put two wheelbarrows right here in the front? Hopefully these guys can distract. So here comes the wheelbarrows. They're rushing in. They've got their app. Did he just deflect the apples? I think the giant just deflected the apples. Oh, right. Okay, so we took out one. Did we take out one samurai? I think that's all we did. And here comes the rest of the units. All the spears and arrows are coming in, but they're deflecting all of them. This guy just got stomped on from a front flip. Here comes all the spears and the arrows. Look at them all. He can't deflect all of them, but he's deflecting a decent amount. Here comes the spear throwers. They're all getting their spears ready. And we took them out. Yes. We took him out. He tried to protect his face from the spears, but we took him out with all of our spears and archers. Perfect. So apparently you just need a bunch of spears, archers. What else do we have? We had some knights and a bunch of squires. It's apparently all you need to take out 25 samurai. So I think that's basically where I'm going to leave it for today. So we've got our army of spear throwers here. So we'll go ahead and end it with them. So I'm going to go and end the episode here. So make sure to leave a like and to subscribe. Thanks for watching and I will see you next time. Goodbye, everybody.